Hello and welcome to the first ever edition of News Glide, your weekly update news show where I fill you in on the latest happenings in and outside the continent of Africa. I am the media maven Odera Collins and guess what? This week is hot and we are starting out in Senegal as Senegalese footballer Sadio Mane has donated the sum of $693,000 and if you know what the economy is now, that is a lot of but anyways, he donated the money to his country to help build a hospital in his hometown of Bambali. I like the sound of that, Bambali. Okay, Bambali is a town which is about 400 kilometers from Dakar, Senegal, the country's capital, and it has existed without a hospital for a while. The Senegalese president acknowledged this donation via its Twitter handle, and this isn't the first time that Sadio has donated to his hometown, as in 2018, he made a donation for a school to be built in Senegal, and he also donated three 300 jerseys to Senegalese people in 2019. I love this guy already, please, who doesn't love a giver? Moving on, top American streaming platform Netflix has introduced a new mobile plan for its African users, Nigeria included. Now this plan goes for $3 a month and is accessible for only mobile phones and tablets. So this means that you can now access Netflix without paying the huge amount. Users would also be able to download movies offline and enjoy the new pay partial download feature that allows them to watch a movie or episode while it's still downloading. Who doesn't like free and nice and beneficial things? Music is definitely a unifying factor and nobody understands this assignment better than our African artists. So buckle up USA cause your summer finna be lit as three of Nigeria's top artists are going to be touring the US of A this summer. And I'm talking about Whiskey or Malay and Mama Africa herself, Yemi Alade. I like how she does it. It's Yemi Alade. Right? Yeah, I think. It's. The godly crooner Omale will be starting off his purple tour in the city of New York on the 2nd of September and it will run through the 11th of September, ending in San Francisco. And Mama Africa herself, Yemi Alade, will be kicking off her Empress tour on the 21st of September in Berkeley, California, running through the 2nd of October in Washington, D.C. And Whiskey's Made in Lagos tour will be running from the 10th of September through the 22nd of January, 2022 ending in Canada, Montreal specifically. Now, Whiskey has a power pack tour for all of you because he has 17 shows lined up. So put your ears on the ground to get all the details if you're in any of these areas. And we go all the way down to Congo, where 24-year-old Shukuru Victor and his team set up a tool called the Volcano Alert Bracelet. Now, the fantastic thing about this device is that it is barcoded and connects to a mobile application that allows users find other displaced persons in cases of volcanic eruptions. Now, if you remember, Mount Niragongo recently experienced a volcanic eruption in Congo and this was quite disastrous. And this device was birthed out of that situation. Don't you just love it when Africans are creative? And in more news of Africans doing amazing stuff, we're heading down to the Gold Coast of Ghana as Zipay, a fintech app, just got $7.9 million in funding to aid its expansions across the continent of Africa. Currently, Zipay exists in over 20 African countries. Just in case you're wondering, Zipay is a fintech platform that focuses on connecting digital assets such as mobile money wallets, bank accounts, ATMs, and a long list of others. So, congratulations to the Zipay team. We hope to see more of this on the African continent. And moving on to more entertainment stories, Ramsey Noah, Mo Abudu, and Andrew Dosumu were just inducted into the Academy of Motion Pictures, Art, and Science, AKA the Oscars, AKA the biggest movie awards of the world. We say congratulations to the three of them because we love them so much. Thank you for putting Africa on the map. Thank you for putting Nigeria on the map. And on that note, we are wrapping it up on this week's edition of News Glide. Don't forget you can get all the full stories on our blog at blueprintafric.com and follow us right here on Blueprint Africa TV for more interesting content. I remain the media maven, Odera Collins, and until next week when I come your way again, bye for now.